Hello everyone. Let me start this tutorial by saying I love Lightworks. It is a video editing software that I use the free version of and outside not being able to render videos in 1080p, it is incredibly feature rich. It has allowed me to make all of my stupid videos which I've wanted to make, which is great, but it has limitations. When large videos are imported or if there's an edit with a lot of things going on, Lightworks can lag and crash causing you to lose lots of work. In this tutorial, I will go over what to do if you a Lose an edit in an otherwise okay project, so you can still open the project but you're lost in edit. B. Lightworks cannot load the project at all without crashing. And C. Imported videos become out of sync, so for an imported video the audio no longer matches the video nor the audio that Lightworks shows in the edit. Unfortunately I cannot show you these errors in the video because they've happened to me before but thankfully they're not affecting me right now, I've had to fix them. But I'll show you how to fix these errors visually. First things first is a handy tip, always back up your projects. Lightworks will back up your edits at specific intervals but if you want to back up a project then you can go into the project that you want, let's go into Bananas Creed there. Um, go to the export, which is the bottom one here, and usually it's on video like YouTube and so you can just render it. If you press the drop down button, you can select backup. And so from here, you can select if you want to include the local and the linked media or make it a bit bigger, um, but then the media become packaged up in the archive. Otherwise, it's just the edits, um, just the edits that are saved. So there is a link in the description to a video that gives more details on how to do this backup manually. This is very important. Usually I make tutorials that are silly and fun, but here I am serious. If you do a bunch of work on a project and think to yourself, geez, I don't want to do all of that work again, please back it up. Save yourself wasted hours of editing. Now onto step one, which is the project is working and you can open it, but the edit that you're working on has disappeared. So this happened to me when I was working on the Pokemon episode, which I have uploaded, but I've, I, I don't have currently. And it, the edit was very busy. There were lots of things going on. And as I was trying to edit it, edit the edit, um, Lightworks crashed. And the next time I opened it, the project opened fine and all my material was there except for that edit. So after many hours of working on that edit, I was like, what the fructus? <laughs> Thankfully, Lightworks does automatic backups, otherwise I would have been screwed. Always backup people, learn from my mistakes. So the way that I recovered my edit was twofold. Um, basically, I was trawling through some Lightworks forums. Um, a couple of those forums are in the description below. So from these forums, then I worked out how to fix a problem. And so the way you do it is, first of all, you go into your folder. I'm at C drive now, users, public, public documents, Lightworks, and then projects. Now, these are all your projects, believe it or not. It's just all coded. So if you go into any specific folder and you go into rooms and hey, look, this is the Pokemon one. It, this is how I tell what the project is from this, this random number. So you can look inside here, you find a .odb and a .odb backup. So this is basically um, the project and a backup of the project. In this case, you can see that these are actually exactly the same. With this Pokemon one, there was a corrupt version, which is the .odb, which didn't have that edit, and thankfully the backup did. So what you do is as follows. First of all, you delete the .odb. Go on, don't need it. Copy the backup. So I've still got that original backup, and now I've got this new backup. And I simply go and delete that, including the .backup. Get rid of that. And then this is my new project file that it loads. And then, interestingly, after I recovered the backup, I closed Lightworks, I opened it up again, still didn't fix the issue. The edit was still missing in the project. So what I did was I went back to the project menu, I clicked on this, I said rooms, and I created a new room. And for some reason, when I entered the project and moved to room two, so it's only one room here, but if I were to create a new room, I'd create room two, went into room two, and sure enough, the edit appeared. Like, I don't know how it fixed it, but whatever. All right, now let's say you're working on a project and Lightworks crashed. So now the next time you reboot the project, Lightworks hangs and crashes. In fact, it doesn't even get into the project. When you double click on the project, it starts thinking and it never gets into the project. So this happened for me with the Honey Pop episode, which is this one here, I still have that project. I think because it's got about seven to eight hours of imported videos, slowing it down. So the answer here is just to wait. Don't click on it because as soon as you double click and it starts thinking, 
the next time you click you'll initiate the Windows login responding error so whatever you do don't click after you've double clicked the project let it think just leave it go away have a cuppa watch some TV seriously I wish I had a better fix but I really don't uh, you just have to let Lightworks do its things correct the errors that were caused by when it crashed mid project or mid edit for me about seven or eight tries in I was very irritated and every time I kept trying to open the project I would click again and then causing the it's not responding error to come up basically all I had to do was double click on it leave the room to cool down watch some cricket can you tell that I'm Australian yet um, and it, it worked I came back and it was in the project and so finally and in this error I can't seem to find anywhere online but it basically for imported video the audio and the video are out of sync and in fact the audio that you hear is different to the audio that is shown in the edit okay that's a bit of a saucy a saucy edit but basically you can see something like there's a sound that goes happens here and in fact if I were to play this video so that that is actually in line with this one the audio in this one is actually correct but for this video earlier it would play the sound at a different time than the waveform illustrated so there are a couple of ways to fix this first of all first of all you can close Lightworks and see if that fixes this, the issue sometimes it does but for more serious versions of this error that I've had which have happened in this honeypot project I noticed that the audio was out of sync in the edit and in the videos and closing Lightworks did not help so the way to check that it's actually Lightworks that's the issue is you go to the video that's imported and you see you click on the video directly and see if the audio is out of sync and in this case it wasn't so it was only out of sync in Lightworks what to do is you don't want to re-import these videos because then you'll need to do the entire edit again so for me I went back to the project selection page right click the project and then selected load from backup or restore items from backup which thankfully wasn't a backup that was too far away it was earlier that day so I, I lost only minimal amount of work and also I created a new room for good measure again room create new and in fact there's the, <laughs> there's the uh, illustration of that room 2 and for some reason that I'm not sure how it fixed it but again that's how it fixed it so this has been a tricky tutorial to do I won't lie this tutorial has brought up some mild PTSD it can be really draining when you get these issues so hopefully this guide can help you out with your Lightworks issues my aim with this tutorial was to show you my suffering so that you don't have to leave a like if it helped you or leave a dislike if it didn't help you and we can commiserate Lightworks issues together um, I might do some more Lightworks tutorials down the line regarding how to do specific edits because I've spent a lot of time in this software um, but until then I hope despite Lightworks issues you have a flippin awesome day